All right, everyone, welcome back to the channel for another video on 7.3 Power Stroke here. Today, I am going to be doing, I guess, one of my first real, like, upgraded aftermarket engine mods, I guess you want to call it. Uh, I'm going to be putting the uh, 6637 filter from Riff Raff Diesel on here. So let's go check it out and see what it looks like. All right, so here's what the filter looks like. When you unbox it, you got this clamp, this little insert piece. And then this is actually just a cover. I went with the red cover because it will match my engine. Here's the filter. Uh, this thing is pretty big. Uh, I mean, this is way bigger than what's in, in there for stock right now. Um, so, I don't know, I heard, heard good things about this filter and I haven't really done much to my truck to make any power or aftermarket upgrades really. Uh, it's pretty much all stock. I mean, I got a straight pipe, but it's not even in, uh, a real straight pipe. It's a, I cut the uh, factory straight pipe. So I could put my stack in there before. Now, of course, we don't have the stack anymore. So uh, this will be the first real upgrade that I'm doing to the engine. Uh, I like to keep it kind of stock. I Maybe this will be a nice little branch into that sort of power mods thing, but um, I don't know. We'll see how it goes. All right, so here's the engine bay and uh, this air filter is, is pretty much done. It's got, uh, the clamps don't clamp anymore. Um, it doesn't really clamp in at all. So I got this bungee cord actually holding it down. So I'm gonna go ahead and take this off. And of course this pops up and uh, there it is. I was looking for a replacement filter and this whole box is kind of a lot for what it is. So I said, you know what, let me go with something aftermarket and uh, branch into a little bit of engine modification, I guess. Uh, because the only thing I really got in here is a DP tuner and uh, everything else on the motor is stock. So it's kind of exciting to, to get this in here, I guess, and see what it does and uh, see if I notice any response or difference. But let me get started. I'm going to take that boot off right here, this clamp, uh, take this piece away. I'm going to take the upper housing of this off and then I'm going to just set my air filter down in there. installed and uh, i just had to tighten these two this sleeve here just kind of fits in between there and uh it looks good hopefully it looks a little tall hopefully the hood shuts but um i like that i like how that red matches what i got going on in here and uh it looks really good so let's go get some sound clips Ladies and gentlemen, there you have it. Uh, it has that turbo cough that I, I like that noise. It sounds good. Hopefully the camera picked it up well, but 
it's a it's a night and day difference um before i couldn't hear anything and uh i mean it wasn't like whooshing it didn't have that whoosh sound or anything now it does and i mean i felt it like this thing was had a little bit of extra power it was pretty responsive too i mean i, I don't know how much performance gain it, it actually gives but it does sound better and i do like listening to that i definitely would recommend this if you like that noise that little turbo cough um that it does i like that and uh yeah so you can see here gauge cluster basically in i was just adjusting some needles and stuff and um, some final adjustments. I did the how-to video, so this is gonna actually be, um, I'm gonna show you when it's like all done, all the panels are put back together, hopefully tomorrow. And uh, that'll be in another video though. But it does work, everything works on it, looks great. Um, get the, uh, the bezel down there, this thing's kind of in pieces, but I'm gonna have all this back together within the next day. So with that said, I think this is gonna be an excellent product for the truck and uh, I'll have a link down below if you wanna purchase it. They have a bunch of different colored covers too if you got some other color going on underneath there. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Hope you guys enjoyed and uh, I will see you guys in that next video.